Um, yeah, I'm, I just got access to my Twitter back. Mm. As a free, as a man, man, as a man, um, and I would consider myself a not just any man, a high value man. As a high value man, mm. currently in his mom's house. You feel what I'm saying? As a high value man, I think this is a dangerous slope uh, that the left is pushing. Left. Oh shit! The left. left, yeah, the left, the left. Because when when you can't say what you what you want to say on platforms, regardless of impact, when they silence you, you know what I'm saying? They don't they don't deplatform women. Oh God. <laughs> Women. I mean, the- there's there's <laughs> something to say about that, but he's, he's nasty with it. They don't they don't deplatform the leftists when they push their agenda. Okay, what about my feelings when that woman the other week said, "Hey, I won't date black men anymore." Yeah, I was gonna say that. There's there's people that do that. Okay, what about that? Listen, man. In all all seriousness. Um, I think my whole take from this thing is like, yo, y'all don't know what freedom of speech is. This whole weekend, every time I've seen this, you don't know what freedom of speech is. It has is nothing. Freedom of speech to... dead? It's come on now, <laughs> and then and then Davis, and then try to defend it like, guys, 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 y'all don't know. A question. Y'all, come on. y'all assume that it's about Andrew Tate. Why you didn't ask this two weeks ago, just on a random Wednesday? <laughs> Shut up, bro. Shut up. Oh my God. You know yeah, bro. Freedom of speech has nothing to do with private entities. Like, come on. Yeah, you know it's crazy. We triggered like one racist kid like five minutes in the pod doing a bit. <laughs> and I was just like, we all know this dude. We're just trolling. <laughs> like, like, we, like, we all know this dude. We're just trolling. L racist. I just like we, we know this, bro. I think I, I think the platforms. Get... I think the platforms have a right to do like what they did legally Next. speaking. Like literally, yeah. when you sign the terms of agreement, that's that's what it is. You agree to to their terms of agreement. Mm-hmm. However, on the flip side. Let's not act like Instagram and all these social media platforms are like, you know what I'm saying, like social justice advocates now all of a sudden. The only reason they're doing this is because it's affecting their bottom line. Like, they don't care. You know what I'm saying? Andrew Tate was on the platform for a majority of this year for a reason. It did, shit didn't happen until it got escalated to what it is now. But that's that's all. Like, they, they have the rights, but let's not, you know, be oblivious to the fact that they don't, they truly don't care. They don't care. Yeah. How long do you think it'll take for him to be? Y'all think he'll be reinstated back on these platforms? Like, you think they'll bring him back on? Nah, that know? dollar. That dollar is fucked up. I ain't gonna lie. To, like mm, these just said, that dollar is fucked up. Imagine being the first brand to unban Andrew Tate type shit. Nah, he ain't, he ain't coming back. He he ain't, he ain't gonna be back. Uh, if if he's not banned on Twitch and he really cares, he might do that. But that's it. That's it. He been he been blocked since 2017 on Twitter and they ain't. They ain't really thought about bringing him, you know. Back. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's not, you know, it's it's not gonna happen. Yeah, but it, it, it social media, and it is what it is. Like like Biso said, there's there's stuff that goes on all the time. People attack women, attack minorities, attack people with disabilities. They're harmful. All this stuff happens. Um, internet moderation doesn't work like that though. So I want people to know that. Um, but yo, this is crazy. The, sorry, what's it called? It doesn't. It, it doesn't work like that. So I want people to know that. But that yeah, they they're the the dollar is so affected right now. They're not even interested in like unblo- unblocking him. They're not thinking about it in the next two, three, four, five. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. The only thing I'll say is it's just it's odd. Like you were doing a bit with the women thing. I'm not going that far because motherfuckers do be wilding. And nigg- niggas do be weird, but I will say it is odd that like this whole genre of people are quickly getting like torn down fast. Like obviously Kevin Kevin Samuels, uh, you know how people feel about Sneeko, Tate obviously getting blicked out. It's just like, do I agree with them shits? No. <laughs> like like most of the time I don't. Well, Kevin Samuels really wasn't that bad, but um, like the other two, no. But it's it's just odd to me at least that for the most part that. A lot of their out of context shit is what's getting them gone. That I, I don't really have too much to say or really can get too detailed with it. But I don't know. It's just like a feeling that I'm like, this is a little weird. I don't know. Maybe I can't explain it. Let me oh, go ahead, go ahead. I was just thinking, what would be like the female there's no female like 
contemporary to like what the red pill community is yeah. in terms of podcasts is it i well, mean i understand we can say like the musicians and stuff but are there women podcasts that are like big and prominent I, right now they probably like, exist i wouldn't be aware women red I'm, pill? I'm pretty positive they exist and if they don't for example it's like even it's not the they, taste degree though yeah it's not the, yeah but like but like in terms but is of it even fresh and fit degree no no no, so no not, are they so they're not as big then they're not as big no oh no no no, no. Let, let me be clear not size yet. Uh, she's climbing. We're talking about what they say specifically. They're not saying the things that that they say in the manner because I think that that also plays a part. The manner in which they say things is also like elevating and escalating the things that you know the the repercussions that they get. So it's not no woman out there like, yeah, you bitch ass woman need to suck your man's dick and submit. Like nobody's no woman is saying that. But there are some women red pillars. I ain't gonna lie. And I've been studying her for a minute. Just pearly things on YouTube. Just just pearly things. I go, she's got the YouTube game in a chokehold right now. But she is a she identifies female red pill woman. She is a so she's what what is, a traditional woman. No, 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 no. I didn't mean females that agree with the red pill niggas. I'm oh, saying, oh. He's saying he's saying the saying someone that's, opposite. So yes. someone that's like, just oh, oh, well, on the oh. opposite end of the yeah, spectrum. Yeah, and, and that's well, what I was saying. Call say. it daddy. Go, go ahead, Sage. Yeah, I was I was gonna say like uh with 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 that I wouldn't be too knowledgeable because I don't watch like watch podcasts and shit like that. But I would say like there's certain trends that have been off the chain type shit. Like there's a trend I seen a couple clips today where niggas would be like just sitting there, like trying to focus and be loyal to the girl, or whatever. And like girls would twerk all on them and whatever. And they got to try to act like they ain't there. In hindsight, if niggas was doing that to shorties, what the fuck? Or like, um, obviously, social standards, shit like that. It's it's just like, it's a lot of lack of consistency, as Dom implied earlier. That I'm just like, bro, if we going to be like this, if we going to de platform people, let's, let's make time. sure Don't let's make sure that it. every time somebody does some fucked up ass shit all right bro you spreading a harmful dangerous message and if the bar has to be high enough to where if this shit is like like damaging many many people so like for example remember the i mean granted it's still a thing but like with um every girl in the world was like if he ain't six feet air, air, like that like if the woman who started that shit got blicked out all right fine but i don't know Oh, no. There's apparently there's some woman out there that my brother said uh they they talk about aborting like all the black babies in the world. Yeah, that was a playback video. Oh yeah, what the yeah. fuck? But they they haven't deplatformed her yet. It, it's it, yeah. it's not a it's not about the like like we're saying it's not about the activism to be quite honest with you. It's about who affects that dollar. I mean Pepsi Pepsi mm -hmm. said hey we'll stop sending money to YouTube if Andrew Tate is on YouTube. YouTube said whoa. Because their moderation doesn't work like that. Like, I think that that's what some people on the internet don't understand. There's not a division on the internet that's like, all right, scour YouTube all day and find where people say this or search these key terms and then sift through them um, and then, you know, ban them or whatever. It, it doesn't work like that. It just They got work. systems, though. I mean, that's what um, streams and videos getting yellowed yeah, up for. And then you ask for a human review. So at that point... You have a human literally looking at your content. Thanks for watching. Let's keep it a buck. If you like that clip, go ahead. Check out this video right here on your screen and we'll catch you on the next one.